welcome to Who Wants To Be A Millionaire? Your chance to win a virtual million pounds by simply answering 15 questions in a row correctly. So if you're ready, let's play. Thanks a million. Is it just you or do you have friends who want to play? Excellent. A whole crowd of you are here. So tell me what kind of multiplayer game you want to play. Fastest Finger lets you all challenge to be the first to play for a cool million. A team game lets you combine your knowledge to see if you can win the jackpot together. And Head to Head will have you all playing against each other a question at a time. That's great. Player one, you first. OK. And now player two. Thanks a million. Then it's player three. Excellent. And finally, play of four. That's fine. Right, time to play fastest finger first. Each of you needs to pick a key on the keyboard to use as your personal buzzer. So, player one, pick a key. And player two, pick a key. Player three, your turn. Pick a key, please. And finally, player four, pick a key. OK, let's play fast first. Starting with the largest by area, put these countries in order. Bangladesh, Barbados, Belgium, Brazil. You've all missed the correct answer. Let's play again. Starting with the largest by area, put these countries in order. Bangladesh, Barbados, Belgium, Brazil. Time's up. So let's see the four... First was D, second was A, then it was C, and finally it was B. Now let's see who got it right, then let's see who got it right in the fastest time. Player one, you're fastest, and you're going to be the first to play who wants to be a millionaire. So first to play is player one. Good luck. Now, I hope you're ready for this. Here comes your first question. It's worth £100. What is the name for the particles of sediment in the bottom of a coffee cup? Grounds. Brittles. Grates. Smithereens. It's good. You've got £100. Here's question two, it's worth £200. Which animals hauled loaded coal wagons underground? Colliery mules. Pit ponies. Mine donkeys. Seam horses. It's good for £200. Right, so far so good. Take a look at this for 300 quid. Which type of person might be described as bonkers? Fat. Mad. Unhappy. Sleepy. You've got 300 pounds. Right, you're 12 questions away from a million. This one is worth £500. Take your time, have a look at it. What is the name of the structure formed by the ribs? Rib pen. Rib pound. Rib cell. Rib cage. You're right, you've got £500. You've still got all three lifelines left. 50-50, phone a friend and ask the audience. 
Right, just be careful. This is the last point at which you could go away with absolutely nothing. You are now 11 questions away from £1 million. This is worth £1,000. Here it comes. In which of these places might you find a barge? Airport. Railway. Canal. Road. Well done, you just guaranteed yourself a thousand pounds. So, congratulations, you're now guaranteed a thousand pounds no matter what happens. Okay, going on. Question six is for two thousand pounds. What type of creature is a sprat? Bird. Reptile. Fish. Insect. All right, take your time. You've still got all three lifelines. You've still got 50-50, phone a friend and ask the audience. So you think the right answer is C. Are you sure? You had a thousand pounds guaranteed. You've now got two thousand pounds. You are now just nine questions away from one million pounds and starting to look at some of the uh, bigger jumps. But remember, the drops are pretty steep as well. Take a look at this for four thousand pounds. In which room would you be most likely to see a rotisserie? Living room. Bedroom. Bathroom. Kitchen. You're going for D. It's the right answer. You've got £4,000. Well done. Right, you're doing well, you're doing brilliantly. You've got £4,000 at this moment. The next question is worth £8,000. Here it comes. Which of these is the name of a biscuit and a royal house? Bourbon. Garibaldi. Nice. Grimaldi. So you think it's A? You had £4,000. You could have walked away. You didn't. You've now got £8,000. OK, keep going if you want to. Here's question nine. You're doing really well. If you play and get it wrong, you'll drop £7,000. If you play and get it right, you'll double your money to £16,000. During World War II, Marshal Petain led the government in which country? Norway. Belgium. Romania. France. OK, you want to phone a friend. Now let's call them, but remember you don't have to go along with what they say. Hello? Hi Ross. This is Chris Tarrant here on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Chris, how's it going? Well, I'm sorry to put the pressure on you, but there's £16,000 at stake at the moment on the answer to this question. I'll help if I can, Chris. Right, here it comes. One question, four answers, but only one is correct. Marshal Patin sounds familiar. And the name is a French sound. So I'd guess I'd say France, but it might be somewhere totally different. Cheers for your help, Ross. Well, there you have it. Ross thinks it's D, but you don't have to agree with him on that. Is that your final answer? You had £8,000. You didn't have to play. You did. 
It was the right answer. You've just won £16,000. You've still got two lifelines, 50-50 and Ask the Audience. So you've now got £16,000. Now this next question is worth £32,000. If you get it right, you're guaranteed to leave with at least that amount of money. But if you get it wrong, you drop 15 of the £16,000 you've got at this moment. You don't have to play this question, but it's worth £32,000 guaranteed. Take your time, here it comes. The former kingdom of Buganda is part of which country? Uganda, Tanzania, Botswana, Zimbabwe. So you think it's A. You did have 16,000 pounds in your hand. You've now got £32,000! Well done, you've now got a guaranteed cheque for £32,000, at least £32,000. Now you're now five questions away from one million. This next question is worth £64,000 and you might as well play this whatever. You can't lose the £32,000 you've already got, that's guaranteed. Have a look at it, here it comes. It's question number 11 of 15. With which form of transport is the name Cessna most associated? Cars. Motorcycles. Aeroplanes. Lorries. So you think the right answer is C. Are you sure? You had nothing to lose by playing this question. And you haven't! You just won £64,000! Oh, take a look at that. It's nice, isn't it? A cheque ready for you for £64,000. But we don't want to give you that. We could well give you a check. The next check is worth £125,000. Now you are at this moment just four questions away from £1 million. Have a look at the next question. You don't have to play it, but it's worth £125,000 if you can give me the right answer. Which famous mountain dominates the harbour in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil? Sugarloaf. Icing sugar. Sugar cube. Sugar lump. OK, time to go 50-50. Computer, take away two wrong answers, please, leaving the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. Well, that's left you with A or B to choose from. So you think it's A? 